How's it hanging, fellas? I'm Otis, and this is another episode of Mortal Kombat 1. And in today's episode, we're playing as Raiden. Starting uh, his chapter, I swear. I didn't show his name because I, it was last episode of the game. And I gotta say, Raiden's chapter is very long. I don't know how long this episode's gonna end up. Maybe like 40 to 50 minutes. Also, one thing that sucks about that this is not a good idea. It is yeah, I was about to say, you're gonna cut off your fucking fingers. Sub -Zero, I will have to thank him for inspiring it. Ow. See? It won't be effective. Also, they never explained how Kung Lao can just summon the cat back and just catch it, no fucking problem. Maybe also, Johnny Cage is here too, and he looks really silly in this fucking... Orange robe. I just need to get on with it. I've been cooped up here for months. I can't base a cinematic universe on Outworld's monsters and magic if I don't ever see them. That's why you're here. Liu Kang said this gig would change the Are we in Outworld? Or is that like, this place looks kind of magical? My aunt will rue the day she gave up on me. <sighs> so selfless. Oh, please, Tattoo. You're just here to get your sword back. We all have our reasons for being here. Some right, it's very nice. Others. But we are not here to fight among ourselves. We are here to fight for Earth. I, I think honestly, rewriting Raiden like that did him a lot of service because time. fucking having him as a god and then just constantly fuck up. Liu Kang is a much better fucking Earth from protector than Only one Raiden one ever's Liu been. King? Isn't Outworld fielding several champions? The tournament's rules give the whole I thought the name of this chapter was The Chosen and One, and it's gonna be Raiden. Uh, know, kind of a spoiler, I guess. I've never asked this, but, uh, <laughs> should have known by this chapter this being Earthrealm and Outworld about Raiden. You should have probably predicted that. But Outworld is gaining strength. Should it win, its more militant factions will be emboldened. I thought you admired Outworld. It is a place of great knowledge, wealth, and beauty. You know what, if Liu Kang is the one who rewritten history in this timeline, could he not have just gotten rid of that stupid 10 wins in a row allows you to take over the other realm rule? Also, I always thought about Outworld probably is on some planet. Like, whenever we go to Outworld and we're over there hanging out with Kitana and Melina, we're on some planet, right? Step forward. And it's probably a universe similar to how Earth is just a planet in a big universe. It's probably the same case <laughs> call, with, call the week first. you know, with fucking you shall Outworld. Face him, Johnny Cage. I kind of doubt Ready that the forces yourself. of Shao Kahn and shit right, conquered the entire this. planet. Remember, farm boy. I'm a and now they're ready to conquer heart. other universes. It's like fucking... Man, just fucking stick to your own realm. Why do you need to fucking merge them so much? One fucking thing that sucks, absolute dicks, about Raiden is that he has one special move. That's it. He's got one fucking combo. Alright, two fucking combos. That's not a combo, spewing heal. That's just his normal fucking circle attack. Oh, I mean, they do show me his other attacks, I guess. And he has one fucking combo, and that's it. Also, I wish I could assign uh, moves to the screen. That was a very neat feature. So we're gonna have to fucking stick with this bullshit for now. Because that's all I have. I don't have a cameo. I ain't got nothing. Also, because there's cameos in this game, you actually can't... Well, that was a How can you do that? You can't grab objects in the background. Those swords on the stand just ask to be grabbed and whacked across his face. But they're not. I can't I can do it. Why save my balls right there? So good news, later in this chapter, stop crouching on me you dickhead. Later in this chapter, 
Alright. Goodbye with my bones. Damn it, I'm trying to do special fucking jackass. Why is everybody playing down so stupid? He's cheering come on, the fucking monk. Such a hype king, you can hype the fucking monks against me. This fight was an honor. Thanks. You're welcome. So fucking nice, I hate you. Kenshi Takahashi, you are next. How is it fair he's fighting with a fucking sword? No, he's a swordsman, but for fuck's sake. You have sake. skills, Raiden, but you're inexperienced. Whatever experience I lack, I make up for in heart. It's nerve, not heart, that wins fights. I should know. I've been in hundreds of them. Fight! Well, 99. But I rounded up the numbers. I was saying something before and I forgot what it was. I don't know. I'm very excited about these new Mortal Kombat games because at least I don't know where the fuck they're gonna take the story. Hopefully not in some garbage fucking direction and we're gonna... Like they're gonna set up a bunch of cool shit and then not deliver. I can't believe I'm still somewhat upset over that fucking Dark Raiden waste. Actually, you know what? There is a series on YouTube like that called Wasted Potential. Somebody does where they're, I think they're talking primarily about Mortal Kombat and characters that could have been a lot better. Also, I'm fucking losing, I just realized. I Alright, I won. I, won't do it I wonder if this game will have some fucking ridiculous fight like Shao Kahn at the end of MK9. That fight was. Ah, oh, I tried to do Johnny move. That fight was fucking insanely awful. Yeah, so my apologies for being late with this game and I'm gonna upload it daily. You may have noticed already, but that's my plan. Daily uploads and one another thing. There's a DLC to Sonic Frontiers coming out, I, I think, this month. I do not. As well. Yours was a well -earned victory. And honestly, I thought once we're done with Mortal Kombat 1, I could actually do a DLC you to Sonic Frontiers me. because it looks this really evening, interesting. You will face your final opponent. Can't believe Sonic's plot got so thick that I actually want to keep up with it. Why did we have to wait until the evening? Kung Lao is my final opponent. It's gonna kick my ass and become the chosen one. Kung Lao wins. Make it interesting. Bet me Sento. <laughs> Not on your life. Raiden, Kung Lao. The winner of this match will represent Earthrealm against Outworld. It is a grave duty. Not to be undertaken lightly. You may step back now. And you know, there's some the fucking summer. anime, the Mortal Kombat movies that came out a while back that had like no marketing. I didn't even fucking knew that they came out. Then may the best person it's like a Mortal Kombat Snow Blind. And it has, it's just like a story. And I think the two main characters are Kenshi and Sub Zero. And it's like post apocalyptic <laughs> world where Kano you. is like. You have never beaten me. Kind of looks like Mad that Max. Where like Kano is no. being a douchebag. Oh, fuck it. No, Kano's the bad guy. Fight. Wow. Not this move. Also, this game's not very brutal, like, yeah, there's blood coming out when I hit people and shit. But other than that... Not... not too much. And I hate how Raiden has no fucking interesting move. He's using the same three fucking things over and over. One move that's constantly in use is the uppercut. See, in MK11, you could, bat, like, jump off this thing, and I would probably do it for no fucking reason. <laughs> What well, he just did with that rake? He did a rake dance, get it? Like lightning. Because break dancing and the rake got glitched up. 
I was doing, I thought I was about to get stuck inside this model or something. Oh, what's raising this crap? I think I did do it before. Shit, now he's got actual cool moves like the Shaolin Descent or whatever. So, and I got that stupid cartwheel kick and that's it. Just keep using that over and over I guess. Though it is easy to do a better version of that move, that's nice. That was close. There is a first time for everything, Kung Lao. Although you have all trained well, Raiden has excelled. This outcome does not surprise me. Maybe it's... Oh, you know what? Maybe... Maybe Kung Lao is... Could I have... Congratulations, Raiden. It's like so what far Kung Lao it. just seems the exact same this. as he was. What if Kung Lao goes evil? And like... He, he gets really fucking jealous of Raiden and fucking kills him or something. Forged by the Elder Gods. Gives the wearer power of a light. What fucking elder gods? Aren't you like the god? Go ahead. Try it. Liu Kang, if you're the elder god who remade the universe, why the fuck did you remade all the shitty things about it too? Balance out the nice thing? Why would you make the elder gods when they were only being fucking assholes? It is incredible. But is it necessary? It should be light thing. Possessing great might, the outworlders you will face also wield great magic. The amulet levels the playing field. You must they be careful. They fucking cheat. That's you what I'm trying to say. Even killed. No tournament participant has ever been grievously injured or killed. I mean, it's the tournament is only called Mortal Kombat. Unwittingly into Mortal Kombat. Yeah, it's called Mortal Kombat. I think they should be killed. I don't know. Fucking the weird, this game is so tame. No one fucking died here. No one got like brutally slaughtered. Well, I guess Adam fucking got melted to death, but... Well, whatever. That wasn't for real, though. That was a movie, so... He's not even dead. To Earth Do not become drawn in. You must focus on the task at hand. Oh, Johnny's got the Johnny tattoo, but on his phone. I wonder if he's got the Johnny tattoo on his chest. Can't see it, he's got a shirt. Oh, who was that? Did someone sneak in? Did someone snuck in with us into Outworld? Someone like ran after us, you saw that? Holding a crate. Wait, what is Shang Tsung's thing? He he's the one you sh you see at the very beginning. I have a feeling we're not Kansas anymore. You know what? I never seen the Wizard of Oz. Check this out. Empress Sindel's daughters. Yes. They're super cute. They do not disappoint. We are Earthrealm's ambassadors, Johnny. We'll show them respect, not unwanted attention. That's Tanya, by the way, and I gotta say one thing about her design. What the fuck is this haircut? It Lord looks Luke fucking King. garbage. Welcome. Look, Thank it's you, Melina Princess and she's Melina. nice. You remember my sister? Of course. How could Princess I forget? Kitana. May I introduce Kitana's Johnny super Kate? cute. Melina's Kung super cute. Kenshi Takahashi Tanya's not. Nice. Tanya's design was fucking awesome in MKX. She had such a nice haircut, and now they Learn fucking ruined it. It's been too long since we've known victory. Tanya's never been we should do very interesting. Way. She always felt like a female awaits. scorpion, Thank and that's it. Tanya. Now she's me, ugly and got a garbage fucking haircut. Worthless. And I ain't calling her ugly because of the fucking skin color. If they just took the fucking design from X. I liked it so much. Could have made her black and I wouldn't give a shit. It's the fucking hair that ruins it. This is fucking stupid. 
can't even see that she's just like the female scorpion that she used to be. Those are Centaurians and Shokan. The six armed beings are not Nadas. The monks are Shilaras. But seeing them in person? Oh, you know what? They could redesign Scarlet. Once again, spares no expense. I don't know how, how, but it commemorates my late father. I, admire I wonder if Melina gets a chapter. I, I hope judge. so. As did all of Outworld, I valued greatly Jared's fellowship. Also, King, J like that's the weird thing. Sindel used to be the queen of Edenia, but now she's the queen of Outworld, and Outworld just. And Edenia seems to be just a one thing combined. Instead of being two different realms. That's the realm Shao Kahn con conquered and killed King Jared and then turned Sindel evil. This couldn't wait. Should I allow well, Sometimes the story is that she that Shao Kahn turned Sindel evil, and then sometimes the story is that Sindel just was evil. The sabotage to her own husband. As soon as first constable, you must show better judgment. Yeah, Melina's not a clone of Kitana expect. anymore. Now she's actually her actual genuine sister, Princess and she really Melina hates Li Mei. Like her very much. Li Mei used to lead the Ungadi, the palace guard. It was on her watch that the princess's father was murdered. I wonder who murdered him. I bet that's important. I love the opening in the MKX when we go to Outworld and the like Kano's. For no purpose. Here's the like knife fight with Kotal Khan. If I lose, really cool. and Melina shows up. Melina also had really great design. It is MK all X. you can control. Yeah, I think MKX designs are some of my favorite. Ormax design was also fucking my favorite in MKX. Red alert. Even though some people Incoming don't like it apparently. And in this General game, Ormax villain design, I mean, looks to. kind of fucking stupid. Some people made fun of him that he looks like Voldemort <laughs> in a hood. He kinda does. Than usual. Shao Kahn now his horns and his head. His will, will prove Shao Kahn's always been like a half enough. dragon person, but I don't think he had horns before. Outworld exists. It is safer that way, General. And yeah, in this game he's called so General Shao because well, he's not the leader of Outworld. You presume them frail, General. Should you, given how frequently they win this tournament? We will destroy your champion, Liu Kang. He will taste no victory. I say otherwise, because I got lightning powers now. And Raiden went from just being shitty because the only thing he had was a fucking cartwheel kick. Now he's got fucking moves, he's got a teleport, lightning, shooting lightning, does the fly across the screen. Except this time he doesn't just fly across the screen screaming. Now he like, kind of descends, which is actually kind of cool. Kind of, I see kind of, oh, very fucking often. Man, this is fucking awesome. Of the I love Royal it. House. And Kitana is super cute and I love her. And Melina too, we she's got bigger tits. To honor my late <laughs> and Sindel's a fucking M-I-L-F. S-F. As if Sindel and Melina aren't evil forest. anymore. Now they're Lord very nice. Empress Sindel. It pleases me to once again be your guest. Here, you are always welcome. They actually do a very fucking interesting now, thing with Ermac. I kind of spoiled myself champion. because I really wanted to see what Ermac does in this game. Is raiding, so I spoiled myself by actually watching the cutscenes that have Ermac in them. The very best Which there's not too many, but what they actually do with Ermac is very you fucking interesting. Nervous, young man. Like I said I'm before, Reptile got land. completely redesigned, and he's fights. now just like a human who yes. can also shapeshift into nervous. a lizard, or more As like the other way around. Be. He's a big you lizard person who can turn shapeshift into a human, but I guess he chooses to stay human most of the time. It has begun. 
Yeah, Scorpions, you know, redesigned the deep now Kual Yang instead of Han or Hatashi. Sub Zero is not really redesigned now that I think about it. He's just the, the first evil Sub Zero well instead of the second with nice Sub Zero. Order. And then also Smoke. I will honor both the Royal House Smoke, and his real name is Thomas, by the way. Because he's so, the adopted brother of Sub Zero and Scorpion. Remember, Man, they're being so fucking hard on Li Mei. You would not be here. Also, Li Mei is also a reoccurring character, but to be honest with you, she just looks like a rip-off Melina. Is your best. The rest I don't know. will take she, care of itself. She's also from the like PS2 yes, era okay. of Mortal Kombat games. Shall we see what you can do? And in this Hopefully, game, she's got like some firework-related abilities. I will That's kind of cool. Earthrealmer. This fight is more important to me than you can ever know. I'm fucking sorry, you're right, but I'm gonna kick your ass. Yeah. Oh, I like it. The fight announcement was actually said by Sindel. Still got my other combos, right? Those ones, but now they're like fucking electric. Actually, from what I heard, Raiden is the biggest fucking nuisance so far. On, like, when you play online. Check it out, I got a cameo with some fucking electric acolyte or whatever the fuck. And I think I just saw Melina scratching her ass in the back. <laughs> oh shit. Yeah, so instead of the cartwheel kick, now we have the flight move. Uh, razzle dazzle. That's the move? That fucking sucks. I wonder if I can do like a better version of this. Uh. Either I fucked up or I can't. There's a lot of spin kicks. Razzle Dazzle, Electric Fly. There's another move that's not listed here, but I do have another fucking move. That's not the one I wanted to do, but that was actually pretty dope. Micro Burst. Micro penis. Oh, I got another one. Did the counter. Right, it's fucking that badass now that he's got lightning. Damn it, is this like the big orb Raiden does? So he like covers the screen in electricity? I forgot how to do it. I think it's like... Damn it, he... I forgot how to do it. Let me see. It's like a fucking move he does. Special moves. Electric Orb. Razzle Dazzle. Shocker, that's the one I just did. Electric Fly. Electromagnetic Storm, I think that's the one. Yeah, that's the one. Now when I fucking enemy gets far away from me, I got a fucking projectile. Projectile moves are fucking awesome. You know one thing, the throne, where Sindel and Melina sit, not in a good position. They don't really get to see a witness or fight very well. Try to make that thing fly away. I dare to say Raiden's so far the best character. Now that he's got my thing. Match, first constable. You know what, Raiden? Your fucking niceness kind of comes off as you being patronizing to these fucking people. I know you're being genuine, but like, you, you just kind of sound like you're fucking just pretending and to be a dick. My compliments, Raiden. Also, I feel really well bad for Lee Mei because so far everyone we'll shits on her. General Shao. Also, she may actually shows up in MKX. Except she's only she's in the cutscene once where she gets interrogated by the special forces because she's like a witness or something. I don't know. They make a really cool design where they gave her like fucking bell pants. 
Also, Reiko, he's another reoccurring character who have, we haven't seen in a while. He looks kind of cool, like some BDSM Mad Max motherfucker. I honestly thought that he's just gonna be like some watered down Kano. Because he has a knife. In whose army have you served? In what wars have you fought? I have done neither. Then you are woefully unprepared, Earthrealmer. This will be your last battlefield. Like, I'm not sure to be honest, Reiko seems uninteresting. He, what is his gimmick? Can you tell me? What, what is Reiko all about? That he's a soldier? Like, he got fucking shurikens? He could easily be just fucking Kano. Kano's thing is that he's Australian. He's better than fucking him. I like an accent going on though. Oh shit, not the red energy kick. I mean, the backgrounds are fucking brilliant in this game. You know, I love Mortal Kombat, but I'm not actually a huge fan of fighting games. The only other one I played. I don't know, the new Street Fighter is fucking awesome though, actually, because it has like a story mode. I may not have faced and it's not just a story mode where you just do towers or watch some shitty cutscenes. And I'm not, I don't mean shitty cutscenes like in this game, because this game is fucking awesome cutscenes. But I mean shitty cutscenes like Soul Calibur's story mode was fucking garbage. He just simply fucking saw two characters on the screen. Oh, that was a nice fucking move. You just saw two characters on the screen, have a conversation, then you got into a fight. And then the characters would just go into a fucking shitty ass conversation. And that was pretty much it, that was how the game played out. I only finished Geralt's story because I just was really curious what the fuck... What was Geralt doing traveling between dimensions in Witcher 3? No Apparently he had to fight a samurai. I am ready for my next opponent. And they did that on purpose, and which are free Whom when Geralt fight uh, travels Patience, in different young. universes. We just to have Geralt appear in different light. games. What if I they brought to Geralt into Mortal Kombat? Banquet. That'd be fucking dope. That could have been like the next big step for special characters. Because you know, like in MKX, they, they had a bunch of horror villains appear as guest characters, right? You had Jason, Letterface. Alien, Predator... Then in MK11, it was like action stars. You hit Robocop, you hit Rambo, you hit... Fucking... who else? Oh yeah, Arnold Schwarzenegger, Terminator. Talk about aging gracefully. She's so cute, I love her. What do you see in him? He is a hero, Raven. See, I thought maybe like Johnny could hook up with Kitana in this timeline and maybe that could like set off the gang. To become evil, he got cock blocked and... From your descriptions, except for him. That is Rain, the high mage. Oh yeah, Rain world. shows up in Not this game. He looks like One a fucking due to his mastery of water magic. Like an Arab. And you know what? He's not a ninja now. He's a Are wizard. Well, princess. Uh, Melina's got I diarrhea. Fine, She's so I know I'm to fight Melina. But will I also face Tonya? By tradition, you should not. If you did, you would be tested. Why? Umgadi, like Tanya, are warrior priestesses, selected from the firstborn daughters of Outworld. From infancy, they are trained to defend the royal family. Outworld must see much conflict. If the Empress but needs such protection. What was I fucking saying? His past has been I got different. sucked in by the plot. Though the last thousand years of Empress Sindel's reign have been a true golden age. The memories of that Oh yeah, how the fuck do they age then? Like, Johnny just gets surprised by Kitana being 10,000 years old. So, you My mean like people in, of Outworld just live way longer than people together. of Earthrealm? Let or is it like days just pass dialogue. differently? Letting no secrets tear our bonds like every ten minutes a day passes or something. Your Majesty. I wonder how old I would be if that was the case. Meet your people. I can Isn't that fucking funny so far? Being a bitch? 
and she just saw uh, his diary all the time. Be more different, champion. She couldn't Excuse sit straight on you the throne roof chair in the background of the last fight. I don't know if you paid attention, but she just like kept almost trying to like get out of the chair. I've enjoyed too much of this excellent wine. Yeah, so Your Shao Kahn in this game. I'm gonna call him Shao Kahn because fucking you who may cares. go. Well, he's not, I guess, the main bad guy. I don't know who the fuck is the main bad guy of this game, to be honest with you. I, I imagine it's gonna be Shang Tsung. It is bad enough we may lose to the Earth Realmers, but then you go and drunkenly insult them? You needlessly stain my yeah, but Shao Kahn and is your family's a, proud one of the bad tradition. guys. See, couldn't you can make Shao Kahn the nicest guy ever? Again with this? At least he's a bit must. more... We must act on the sorcerer's prophecy. He warns that Liu Kang will conquer Outworld. And his predictions are usually impeccable. But I've no proof of Liu Kang's ill intent. His interventions have kept Outworld at peace for centuries. He herds us into compromises, shackles our independence. If we could meet our enemies in battle, we'll take- You would consign us to endless war. Better that than be Liu Kang's lapdog. See, that's if what I, I was saying. Why does Outworld wants to conquer Earthrealm? Isn't Outworld a big enough place where it has, command. like, multiple countries and shit? Did not your Couldn't they go and conquer some other fucking part of Outworld that hasn't been conquered first. by their kingdom yet? He did, your majesty. Also, they say Do not his father... I don't know, is Onaga gonna show up? They should redesign Onaga and have that be like the main bad guy or the fucking. There's this one bad guy. You asked to see us? Blaze, I get could, I saw what could happened this evening. This Blaze is supposed to be very powerful. Uh, there was nothing. It was something I ate. Was it? Blaze is I the one who fucking it, brought I? down the if entire you original tomorrow, timeline. The of your disease could manifest. It's also Katana like this fucking take your place. thing called the One what? Being, uh, there are already whispers she which is like a me as your heir. character who has this apparently created the universe, but I guess in this timeline, Liu Kang created the timeline. Me. I just needed time alone, away from all this. I never thought that... That's your problem, Melina. You never think. A mother is only trying to protect you, sister. To be a bitch becomes known, you will be banished to the way for you to hold the throne. We must keep your secret. Oh, yeah, that's another really huge difference. So, you know how Baraka his ugly teeth and sharp claws that's because he's a Tarkata, right? A race that Among is like that. You have defeated Koto, Motaro, but in this, and Shiva. oh, Only she really Koto. Are you ready, Earth Realmer? Couldn't we have fucking I seen that? Majesty. That'd be dope. Then next you face my daughter. Katana. I don't wanna fight Katana, she's too cute for that. Your Majesty, this is unprecedented. Raiden's next opponent should be your heir. Melina is unavailable. She's away on she's pressing got, uh, imperial diarrhea. But I have not prepared. She's stuck in the fucking shitter. Her. He's already demonstrated great skill. Can he not improvise? Your Do next challenge, Raiden, will be a mirror match. Very well. Actually, I, I guess that could make sense if there's magic in Outworld. They could just clone him or make a mirror, no put a mirror delusion, spell on him. Your Highness. I will win this fight. For her, my Empress, and all of Outworld. My gosh, fight. she's cute. I love her. But I gotta kick her ass now, fuck. I, I fucking give up, I submit. No, I don't wanna fight her. Oh yeah, I was saying, so, you know, when MK11 they got action stars up here. Maybe the next step is actually have different characters from different games show up. They could spawn. Spawn had some video games, I think. Oh man, fucking this up. I got a different move now, now that 
I got electric shit. I imagine when you pick Raiden, like from the main menu, you just go into a fight and pick Raiden. He already has lightning, right? You don't have to fight with lightning left Raiden. Fucking hit the option button. Ah oh, man, keep trying to fucking do these upgraded versions of my moves, and I keep fucking it up. I'm sorry about that. I, I'm so sorry. You fight well, princess. All bruised up, you, fucking coughing uh, blood. Surprisingly so. I hope we meet again. Under different circumstances. That's how Raiden asks it's a girl on a date. Final match. Kicks her ass and then. It's a testament to your ability that, that like you that. made it thus far. Since but Raiden is this must face new timeline's equivalent of, Lin, of Liu Kang. Is he gonna date Katana or is he gonna date Melina? That'd be really interesting. Check it out, Shao Kahn instead of a hammer now has an axe. As has his family for generations. General Shao defends us oh, sorry. with zeal and Did I just say that Shao Kahn conquered Nevada? That's a notable he started, he started Las Vegas. It is a mere fraction of them. A full oh, humble. recitation would take days. Fight. Oh, we got time. So I humiliate him, like, to do a flawless fucking victory. Alright, never mind. I already fucked up. Truthfully, I'd get my ass killed if I didn't hit my fucking lightning. You know who they could have brought back again? Again, Earn Black. Earn Black is such a fucking cool character, but the thing is, the thing is, playing as him is kind of difficult. At least I've always found it difficult and didn't really like playing as him. He's cool. I don't know. Look at him fighting and listen to him and cutscenes and shit. That's the one fucking thing that I always found annoying in Mortal Kombat stories. Not every. There would be like characters the story focuses on, and there's like characters like Ermac, Reptile, Baraka. Characters that have like one or two fucking lines, and then just kind of don't really say much other than that. Uppercut for it's the win. Right. It can never go wrong. I have done it. You know what? For a big fucking tournament that is super fucking important. Earth Realm wins. I thought it would be in like a coliseum, not just like in front of three fucking chairs they put on some fucking balcony. Kind of lame. How many people were watching that? Fucking ten. May I assist you? Stay away. Yeah, Raiden, you're being too nice, you know, like... Well done. Just genuinely you comes off as you being just... Patronizing Thank everybody. You, Lord Liu Kang. May because I assist you, you fucking the feeble who and... The peace will once again be held at bay. Stupid fucking idiot. Come. Let us bid our hosts farewell. You know what sucks about SD cards? I, was, I went to a store yesterday to buy an SD card and I was like... All of these SD cards are like one terabyte and they're expensive. I just need a fucking small, like 30 gigabytes of space just to copy some files from the Steam Deck onto my computer. I don't fucking need... I only need it to transfer files. I don't need to follow a lot of files for a long time. Oh, check it out. That's one character Garris. introduced in MK11 who comes back. It's, it's Garrus. Garrus? It's good to see you. 
If his name was Gears, it should have been spelled G E A R S. Or whatever his name is spelled, I can't remember. I'm actually Seriously glad he comes back because he was cool. And instead of just being chronic a sidekick, being history's architect drove her mad. I had no wish to share her fate, which is why I am forever grateful that you volunteered to safeguard the hourglass. Yeah, so my having I guess Gears. The new era has unfolded as it should. Gears is the same, except now he's nice. It's cool you because he's a cool character. In your own image. Duty is my highest calling. The wife well, you made you black. You are, here. you are not one for social. <laughs> he's made in your own is image. There trouble with the hourglass. With something it has shown me. What, Gears? When you restarted history, you altered the destinies of certain malefactors to neutralize them. At least one of them is defying that destiny. Shang Tsung. You made Kano a volunteer at a puppy. He has escaped his meaningless life uh, and is on his way to becoming a powerful sorcerer. Yeah, what if Kano shows up and he's just like the nicest guy you ever met? Such a I saw no sign of him during the tournament. But if that snake is in Sindale's ear... There's some cameo characters, and Kano is a cameo character, he seems as a... I imagine I that even though Ka Harris. Kano doesn't actually appear in the story, Please return I imagine the that the cameo See appearance of learn. Kano is what Kano in this universe looks like. So he still seems like a jackass. Except maybe now he's so part of the Red Dragon Clan instead of Black Dragon Clan, even though that doesn't yes. fucking matter, because these clans never really get much lore established about them. And I was right, this episode was way longer than the last one, almost twice as long. Actually, never mind, it was like only 10 minutes more long, but it was still longer, 40 minutes. Right, I had a lot of fights. I imagine the next one's not gonna be as long, and the next one I actually have no idea what happens in it. Unless I play it today on my other account. Because I have to play this game. Since you can't have multiple save files of the story mode, I have to play this game and record it on a different PlayStation account than I normally do. Which kind of sucks, but whatever. See you fellas in the next episode, bye.